today we will show you how to take the density of water okay so this is the hydrometer we will use this one to measure the density of the water technical problem the rope length is less <laughs> the rope was less so now we have to bring another rope see now there is another technical problem now the water is less so it is sitting at the bottom it should not sit at the bottom so we have to pour some more water so this is the second technical problem all right so now today we will show you how to take the density of water and i'll introduce my carrot is mr key how to say it correctly Kiel. Kiel. Okay, he is Mr. Kiel, and uh, now what we'll do is we will fetch out water from the river, and then we'll measure the density. Now Mr. Kiel is going to fetch out water. It's a river, so prob probably the uh, density should be around one fresh water, but let's check and find out. technical problem the <laughs> rope length is less <laughs> the rope was less so now we have to bring another rope just now mr kale has got another rope and he will join this one with the previous one to make it a uh, little longer make fast a good knot otherwise your bucket will remain in the river only <laughs> Okay, let's go. Second attempt of fetching water from river. Go, so, finally the bucket has touched water and it's diving down. You must having the same feeling when you take out the water from well. Oh, okay. Good exercise for cadet. Yeah, really good. Here we go. Twenty pounds. Now we have this water from Savanna River. Okay, so this is the hydrometer. We will use this one to measure the density of the water. If you can see, there are grooves, there are markings on top of this one. The marking, if you can read, this is 1.040, 1.030, 1.020, 1.010, 1. Usually one is the density of fresh water and salt water is 1.025 so it is in between somewhere here so this is a river water so i'm expecting the density should be around one so let's find out so we have to wait until it settles down and then we'll read the uh, graduations read the marking on top of the hydrometer water is less it should not sit at the bottom it is sitting at the bottom so it will not give you the correct one you uh, need more water you need more water yes for another bucket see now there is another technical problem now the water is less so it is sitting at the bottom it should not sit at the bottom Basically, it should float. Then only it can give you the exact density. So we have to pour some more water. So this is the second technical problem. 
Okay, so this is the third attempt. Hopefully, this should be the final attempt. Perfect. This was the perfect catch. Really doing hard work. <laughs> really like it, huh? Great. It's good that you like it because you don't have any other option. <laughs> so better you enjoy what you do. I probably should go down the gangway. Really? And here we go. Wow. Okay. Oh, that should be more than enough. Okay, bring our hydrometer. Put this down. Okay. Now let it settle in the water. Okay, you guess how much it should be. Although I've already told, but still, just make a guess. Probably. 1.1 1.1 of you mean 1.010 right no, 1.1 because it's between the river water and the no 1.1 is too much even salt water is 1.025 oh. so 1.010 i mean oh, okay. okay maybe 1.005 maybe it's very close to fresh water is it settled looks like settled let's see let's read out the marking uh, how much? How many graduations more? Looks like 1.002, huh? One point. Okay, this is one, and it is just on the second marking. So 1.002. Yeah, that's the perfect reading. What we can get 1.002, and then we make sure that it is not sitting on the bottom. So we'll just tap on top, and you see it sinks down means it was not sitting on the bottom so this is how you can check the density of the water like i said it should be very close to fresh water and fresh water is one and this is 1.002 oh perfect okay mr kale so how was your experience really good to be my first time doing the test with a hydrometer Okay, good. So now you know two, three things. What is hydrometer? How to check the density? Uh, how much weigh a bucket full of water? Yeah, how much uh, bucket full of water weigh? And more important, how much rope you should use? The length of the rope and what? and how much water you should fetch? Ah, yeah. Okay, good. So we are done with the measuring the density of water, and we found it at 1.002 which is very very close to the fresh water density since it is a river savannah river and uh, we came around uh, 20 around 18 to 20 miles inside uh, sea so that's why here this uh, water is very close to fresh water